heading off to go and pick up Naomi from work so we can go and do a bit of riding. The uh, weather's been pretty bleak all day. <coughs> As you can see, the clouds aren't fantastic. But you get that. We're going to go do some riding. I haven't ridden on the, the Snot Rocket since I watched it a few days ago. I'm very keen to get back on that. I've successfully retrieved Naomi from work. Thank God. So we're out, ready to start the trail. We're gonna head straight down there, head up to Top Shelf. So I'm gonna give Naomi a 30 second head start and see how long it takes me to catch up. 30. There's a rock there. I think I just <laughs> bent my disc on my front rider. Oh, I thought I was going over the bars for sure. There's Naomi. I haven't caught her up yet though. She's on an e-bike. Caught you. And she's off again. And... Sounds like I did something to my crank too. I hope I haven't done anything to my crank. Carbon crank and all. That really does not sound good. Absolutely no sign of Naomi. She's just gone. Oh, there she is. So I kind of caught up with her. I think I may have broken my crank. I think so. Sounds like it. I thought I might have um, broken my carbon crank when I hit that big rock earlier, but it's possible it just may have come loose with that preload tensioner. Hopefully it's just the tensioner because it's making some horrible grinding noises otherwise. Just get in there, take it apart, pack it more grease, put it back together and check, check for any uh, carbon cracks of course. And pray to the mountain biking gods that it's not broken. Exactly. Pray hard. Thank you. 